So. <clears throat> Four, say anything. I was thinking about a Q&A. Let me know down below in the comments if you would show up or be interested. Because Q&A ain't no fun if you ain't do with that shit live. You know what I mean? Anyways. Because you... Y'all can see, I got freshened up, moved shit around a little bit, got comfortable, and got to go out, run some errands, get some shit done, and, uh, yeah, be on a minute, cheers. So, side note, if anyone lives in the Dallas, Fort Worth type of area and are open to do like a meetup or something like that, or even a collaboration, whether that's video or music, let me know. Because I definitely will be going back. I want to say hopefully soon. But it's really. I don't know. Sorry if I just keep on like. Looking over here. Because I'm really trying to process. And look through my brain of damn I haven't done a video in a minute what do I want to show what do I want to say like shit let me know how y'all been let me know how y'all been let me load up Hmm. Probably my Sherlock, and this is gonna be the last bowl, cause I'm gonna clean this layer tonight. I said that on video, y'all got my word. So, without saying too much. I did record a little freestyle last night, and literally, I think I did the video, and then I recorded. Like, it was, like, I didn't have time to fucking chill, fucking take my shoes off, fucking nothing. So I want that shit. Um. Once again, I'm just trying to think of what I want to tell y'all and what I want to surprise y'all with and... I don't know. I'm definitely going to be making more music and getting back into producing again on the bright side. If there will be new music released, probably. Yeah. Yeah. There will, there will, there will be new music release. Will there be an album or a mixtape released? It might be in the works. 
That's all I can say. I just take it day by day. Live my life. Try to be positive. Try to be happy. Try to motivate myself and others around me. This is pretty fucking dirty. I'll put a full bowl in this because that is not killing to me. It might be on Fire Flame Channel, but when I got this, it's pretty much clear pink glass. Or clear glass with a pink tint. When do I have? <sighs> yeah, then when I get done with everything I need to get done, run my errands, get some groceries, I'll be chilling all night. I'm be chilling all night. Then my bracelet always hits the table because I know y'all hear that shit. Smoking on some AK-47, some homegrown outdoor. Cheers. So, I will say go to Dallas. The trip itself, spontaneous as fuck. Another spontaneous as fuck thing I did involving money. And I remembered that I do want to show these. Just give my opinion, because, like, oh, nor am I chipped ass now. They are so, so weedy tasting. That's the best way I can describe the taste. There is a weed fucking aftertaste. And to keep it a buck, this is the first ever time last night, to be exact, or yesterday. The first ever edible. Official edible ever tried. But these are 25 milligrams. Comes with 10 and bag. I just read that, no cap. But if you are a heavy daily smoker, I had to take two before I even felt like. Okay, I'm feeling a different pot. Why are you back? I love to the red. Ugh. Ugh. Damn, last minute. This shit just looks like it's right out of fucking Rick and Morty, too. I used to play fucking Pocket Morty. Salesman Rick. There he goes, man. That's fucking Willy Wonka, Rick. I'm high as hell. I'm high as hell. Eee, the 
other way. Shout shoe nice. OG shoe nice. Cheers. Right through two on the way there. And then as soon as we left. As we fucking hot bots. Fucking my little bro's car. <laughs> Man, I mean, it's probably because I was non stop smoking on the way to Dallas in Dallas and back from Dallas. I didn't feel those two edibles. There might be a little bit cap in there, but you know. I ain't Polo G either, you know. I ain't Mr. Capilot. <laughs> I'm my own world, bro. I'm my own world. I bought this a few days ago thinking it was... My back just popped. Thinking it was the lemon ice one. I actually got banana ice. Ain't bad. Banana lemon ice. You feel me? Like it's like comparing sweet tea to like some peach snap. Same, but day and night. You feel me? But yeah, uh, I played GTA on um, fucking dude I met down in Dallas. I played on his PS4, and it was my first time ever playing GTA. I'm so high. Five? Five. I'm fucking first person on the PS4. And that shit, like... I'm glad I didn't waste all that money on PS4 just to play GTA 5 in first person way back then. Because even though I got the money for shit like gaming systems and shit like that, I don't be my interest. I'd rather do something that is meaningful or that will impact uh Im impact the longevity of my legacy or impact the longevity of thinking about too much now I just Thought about it. Uh, also, shout out my little homie. Like, he had. I don't even remember what he said. If he had lunch, or someone had given him lunch. But yesterday, when he came over, he just gave me a bag and he's like, da da da. And pretty much gave me fucking. A bag with a sandwich, some chips, some broccoli and ranch. Uh, broccoli is in the trash can, and if you ever bring anything around me that is green and grown, it better be smokable. It better be smokable. I'll be sure to let him know that. <laughs> uh. Cheers. Uh. 
as a uh, taking it day by day. There might depend on when I do it and what happens. There might could be a giveaway in the Q and A video I was talking about earlier. If y'all would be interested, and also let me know that. And if you have already commented, commented, commented. Just drop it under your own comment, like you're talking to yourself. I do it on Instagram all the time. That's more like a side note to a side note. Of, it's more or less, bro. Why ain't you on Twitter? Why don't you just use Twitter? It ain't vibe. It ain't the vibe. Just keep it a buck. Cheers. I really do apologize because I'm even noticing I'm a little high for this video, but I spontaneously went to Dallas fucking yesterday. For that, I had another homie chilling with me for like a day or two. And then, for that, I record a song with my homie. Like, bro, I just been go, 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 go. It keeps my mind off a lot of bullshit. I don't want to think about. Bro, I'm not married. I don't want to say that. I'm not married. I want to be married one day. But I am more or less committed to the money. You, you feel me? Um... I'm stupid. Yeah. I told my dad and he did agree with me a few days ago when I did talk to him. You know, why not work as much as you can and do as much as you can while you're young and you still can. Cheers. Y'all like the hat? Y'all like the hat? Let me know. <laughs> Anyone who actually answers everything I said is gonna drop like a minimal, or yeah, minimal of at least three comments if you follow everything. <laughs> Did we get it? I haven't made a video in a while. That's on you. Yeah, I feel my team. That's also on me. So, it is what it is, but I don't want to keep y'all for too long because I need to get shit done. I don't want to get lazy or stuck. But, uh, did one. Tess fell late to head and say, somehow, I'm becoming a fancy ashtray collector. I got problems. I got 
have problems. Now you need to scrape, scrape in the surface of dumb shit. But, uh, I shouldn't say dumb shit, just like new shit I haven't showed y'all guys or haven't. Um, man, I'm gonna do some thank you while I'm out. Hopefully, later or even tomorrow, depending on how I'm chilling. Come at y'all with more of a laid back chill, Freddy. Cause came back from Dallas like I don't know I say or whenever I dropped that video to be honest you know, like an hour a few hours Kermit sipping the tea meme you feel me. <laughs> but on that note, don't get depressed. Stay motivated. If you have a vision, build. Build your vision. If you can visualize it, you can do it. Always follow your heart. Do what you gotta do. On that note, I'm gonna spread nothing but peace, love, and positive vibes. And as always, love you guys. Remember that. Don't always hit me up. But peace out.